Attention, please. Attention, please. Thank you. Thank you all for being here and for your attention right now because when there's golden palace egg rolls, who wants to hear a speech, right? Yeah. Anyway, my name is Jim Durrell and uh, I've had the privilege of uh, knowing the mayor for many, many years and uh, I'm obviously a very big fan or I wouldn't be here today. Uh, I use a saying often when I, I, I speak in leadership groups and I talk about the speed of the leader is the speed of the pack. Amen. And, you know, when I look at what our mayor has done over the past seven and a half years mm -hmm. in building this city, it's remarkable. He's Amen. been Amen. He's been consistent, and what I also like about him is not only does he get things done, but he does it with integrity. Uh -huh. Integrity and passion. Mm -hmm. And those two combined mean that we've got a very, very good mayor in this city, and a mayor we can all be proud of. Yes. To be mayor isn't easy, and uh, this mayor takes nothing for granted, just like he does all things in life. He works very hard, mm -hmm. and that's why today he's out door knocking, and people say, why are you out here? Like, well, what are you doing now? <laughs> it's because he is engaged with you and I as citizens. Amen. That's important. And he will continue to be, and he'll continue to provide that leadership. You're going to see people here with uh, Jim Watson t-shirts and whatnot. Uh, sign up if you can uh, for a lawn sign uh, as a volunteer. We don't want the mayor out there alone at nights walking the streets. <laughs> even, though, even though it's a safe city, right? We still want him out there so that everybody knows. And if you are really uh, fired up for 50 bucks donation, you can get your own Jim Wimson, like in The Simpsons. <laughs> Jim Watson t-shirt. Voila. All right, which is the best 50 bucks you'll ever spend. <laughs> Thank you again for being here, and let's uh, give it up right now for a great leader and a great mayor, our mayor, Jim Watson. <laughs> Jim. Alors, merci beaucoup, Jim. Uh, Jim est un vrai leader dans notre communauté et c'est un honneur pour moi uh, que Jim m'appuie uh, ma candidature comme maire de la ville d'Ottawa. So, Jim, thank you for your continued leadership on so many different fronts. Uh, thank you for coming in such big numbers. Uh, where I think we're still trying to get them in the front door here. If you want to come on up here, yeah, come Laura on up. and uh, others. Uh, and uh, we'll, we'll yell a little longer. We, we didn't want to waste money on a sound system, so uh, we're going to you know, belt it out. Uh, really pleased to be joined by a couple of elected uh, officials here. Uh, Jean Cloutier, my good friend from Alta Vista. Welcome, Jean. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for coming to our office opening. Uh, we're very, very proud of this. Uh, little office we have. It's in my old neighborhood of Old Ottawa South, which I'm, I had the honor of representing for a number of years as city councillor. Uh, I also want to thank our core uh, campaign team executive and our interns, most of whom are in the, the red uh, uh, vests, uh, sweating it out here, wearing a red vest. That's dedication. Thank you very much for that. Uh, they put this event on, all of the interns, and they deserve a big round of applause. <laughs> Les bénévoles sont uh, vraiment importants pour une campagne uh, et je suis um, uh, très honoré d'avoir presque 400 bénévoles qui uh, ont signé uh, pour aider moi avec la campagne. So we have close to 400 volunteers, but we always need more, so we'd encourage you to please see uh, some of the folks in the Jim Watson shirts or vests or a clipboard and, and they can get uh, you signed up. And of course, campaigns uh, cost money. It costs money to rent this facility, uh, rent equipment and so on. And uh, any a donation is gratefully accepted. And I think we do the donations uh, through Patrick, if I'm not mistaken. So Patrick, give a wave here. Thank you. So this is uh, going to be an interesting campaign. It starts really uh, after Labor Day. That's when people start engaging in the campaign. I was out today, as Jim said, in Canada North, knocking on doors. 
and people are often surprised. Like this one woman said, I think the mayor's at our front door. And, um, <laughs> I said, yes, I am, and I'd like to continue being mayor and uh, uh, talk about some of the issues that are important to the people of Ottawa. And uh, I, as Jim said, I don't take anything for granted. I very much uh, believe that, uh, you know, you, uh, uh, the, the greatest enemy of a candidate is complacency. If you simply think, oh, you know, I've got it uh, wrapped up, I'm not going to do any hard work, uh, you're going to be thrown out of office pretty quickly. So I don't take uh, anything for granted. I'm honored each and every day I walk into City Hall to represent uh, the people of Ottawa. Pour moi, c'est vraiment un honneur de représenter non seulement la ville d'Ottawa comme uh, notre place de résidence, mais aussi la capitale nationale de notre pays. So it's a real honor for a guy who came from a small town in Quebec to uh, uh, have the honor of being the mayor of the nation's capital. And I'm proud of what we've been able to accomplish uh, collectively together. Uh, light rail transit, a gentleman was just showing me a picture he took at Herdman Station of the trains. My husband, tested. Tom. That's right, yeah. my husband, Tom. Uh, that, that project is going to be a game changer. And after years of false starts, we got shovels in the ground, the trains are being tested, and we'll have light rail by the end of this year. That's something I'm very, very proud of. We'll just leave a little bit more room. There's Isabel, superstar canvasser. Come on in, Barry. Don't tell the fire marshal. I think we were sitting here. How are you? Nice to see you. We've also uh, put a, a great emphasis on the environment, whether it's uh, providing a better cycling infrastructure, planting more trees, uh, making sure that we clean up the Ottawa River with the Ottawa River Action Plan. These are all things that, again, were talked about for a long time. We're doing them this term of council. We recognize that people have concerns about the quality of our roads. We have to do a better job. We put an additional $12 million into the budget to uh, fast track some important uh, projects. I was out in rural Ottawa the other day. Stagecoach Road is like you could uh, skate on it. It's so smooth. They, the staff are doing a great job of playing catch up after years of neglect. And of course, we're investing in communities, whether it's the Ottawa Art Gallery, which has just been a tremendous success in its first uh, month, 22,000 people walk through the doors of the Ottawa Art Gallery. Uh, the Innovation Center is bursting at the seams with people wanting to create the jobs of today and tomorrow. And we've seen the unemployment rate at a 30-year low at 4.2% right here in the city of Ottawa. So uh, in order to get that message out, we need uh, good volunteers, a good campaign strategy, and we're really pleased for the second campaign in a row Danielle McGee is our campaign manager. She and uh, the whole team are doing an amazing job, and I thank her and uh, all of the executive, and I'm not going to go down the slippery slope of starting to name people, because I do that all the time, and I get in trouble when I leave someone out. So uh, thank you all for coming out. Uh, again, we need uh, volunteers uh, almost every evening when we're out canvassing, uh, putting signs up in the fall. Uh, going and doing some phone uh, phone canvassing as well. Uh, all you need to do is let us know uh, when you're available and your coordinates and we'll get in touch with you or check our website uh, jimwatson.ca for opportunities for more events. We'll have another campaign kickoff in September as well and we invite you to that uh, opportunity to come and uh, celebrate democracy in your own backyard. So finally, uh, we just, we've just some uh, Great uh, local companies back there, Golden Palace Egg Rolls. I know you're here for the egg rolls, not for me. We're here for you. I can take We're that. here for you, Mr. So, uh, Watson. Help yourself. We're at the back, and there's a tent outside if it gets a little uh, warm in here. Uh, there's refreshments, uh, pop and so on in the fridge, coffee on the side, and Timbits. We can't have an event yes. without Timbits. Right. So have I said everything I'm supposed you to, have. Danielle? Yeah. So ladies and gentlemen, mesdames et messieurs, merci encore pour votre appui. Merci pour votre dévouement. Et merci uh, d'être un bénévole ici à la campagne uh, pour moi comme maire de la ville d'Ottawa. Thank you for volunteering, for showing up, and for uh, supporting me as mayor uh, of this wonderful, blessed city we call home. Thank you. We're going to have everyone in the background get the cameras up there, and Jim will help me here, and Liam. Everyone gather up. Jim, Get a big crowd back here, guys. Come on in here. Come on in here.